Chapter 1. The Eco-Savvy Green Grocer Growing Sustainable Produce In a small town called Greenville, there was a green grocer named Mr. Johnson. He was known as the Eco-Savvy Green Grocer because he believed in taking care of the environment while providing fresh and healthy produce to the community. Mr. Johnson's store was filled with all sorts of fruits and vegetables. He grew them himself, using sustainable food solutions. This meant that he used natural methods to plant and nurture his crops without harming the earth with harmful chemicals. Every morning, Mr. Johnson could be found in his garden, tending to his plants. He would water them, pull out any weeds, and make sure they were getting enough sunlight. He knew that growing sustainable produce required a lot of hard work, but he loved every moment of it. One day, a young girl named Lily visited Mr. Johnson's store with her mom. She couldn't help but notice how fresh and vibrant the fruits and vegetables looked. Curiosity got the better of her, and she asked Mr. Johnson how he managed to grow such amazing produce. Mr. Johnson smiled and said, Well, Lily, it's all about taking care of our environment. Instead of using chemicals, I use compost made from leftover food and plant scraps. This compost adds nutrients to the soil, making the plants grow strong and healthy. Lily was amazed by Mr. Johnson's eco-friendly approach. She wanted to learn more about sustainable food solutions, so Mr. Johnson invited her to his garden the next day. When Lily arrived at Mr. Johnson's house, she was astounded by the sight. Rows and rows of plants greeted her, each one growing tall and lush. Mr. Johnson explained that he also used rainwater collected in barrels to water his plants, reducing water waste. Wow, Mr. Johnson, you really know how to take care of the earth, Lily exclaimed with admiration. Mr. Johnson chuckled and said it's essential, Lily, taking care of the earth means taking care of ourselves. When we eat fresh and healthy produce, we become stronger and healthier, too. Lily nodded in agreement, realizing the importance of sustainable farming. She started helping Mr. Johnson in his garden, planting new seeds, and pulling out weeds. Together, they enjoyed the peaceful atmosphere and the satisfaction of growing their own food. As time went by, Lily became more knowledgeable about eco-savvy practices. She shared her newfound wisdom with her friends and family, inspiring them to think about how they could contribute to a greener world. With Lily's help, Mr. Johnson's Green Grocer Store became a popular spot in Greenville. The community appreciated the care and effort he put into growing sustainable produce. They knew that by supporting him, they were not only getting delicious food, but also protecting the environment. And so, the eco-savvy green grocer continued his mission of providing fresh, healthy, and sustainable food solutions to the town of Greenville. Together with Lily and the community, they created a greener and brighter future for everyone. Question. How can a green grocer contribute to sustainable food solutions? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 2. The Eco-Savvy Green Grocer Promoting Local Agriculture The Eco-Savvy Green Grocer, Mr. Johnson, loved promoting local agriculture and supporting farmers who grew food in their own backyard. His store was filled with fresh fruits, vegetables, and other delicious goodies. Mr. Johnson believed that eating locally grown food was not only good for our health, but also for the environment. Every morning, Mr. Johnson woke up early to visit the nearby farms. He would carefully select the best produce and bring it back to his store. He knew that these fruits and vegetables were grown without using harmful chemicals that could harm people and the earth. One sunny day, Mr. Johnson had a brilliant idea to spread awareness about the importance of eating locally grown food. He decided to organize a farm-to-table event at his store. He invited local farmers to showcase their products and share their farming techniques with his customers. 
Mr. Johnson decorated his store with colorful banners and signs that said, Support local farmers and go green with locally grown. When the day of the event arrived, the store was buzzing with excitement. Customers came from all around to learn about local agriculture and taste the delicious food. There were samples of freshly picked strawberries, crisp lettuce, and juicy tomatoes. The smell of homemade bread filled the air, making everyone's mouth water. Mr. Johnson stood at the entrance, greeting all the visitors with a warm smile. He explained how buying locally grown food not only supported farmers, but also reduced harmful carbon emissions from transportation. He encouraged everyone to shop at his store and other local markets, as it helped create a sustainable and eco-friendly community. As the day went on, children gathered around a table where a farmer was showing them how to plant seeds. Each child held a tiny pot and carefully placed a seed inside, imagining the vegetables they would grow in their own gardens. Mr. Johnson watched their excitement and felt proud of the positive impact he was making. There was also a workshop on composting, where people learned how to turn their kitchen scraps into nutrient-rich soil. Everyone got excited about recycling their organic waste and reducing landfill pollution. Mr. Johnson gave away small compost bins to those who showed the most enthusiasm. The farm-to-table event was a huge success. Mr. Johnson had achieved his goal of promoting local agriculture and educating people about the benefits of eating locally grown food. The townspeople had a newfound appreciation for the farmers in their community. After the event, Mr. Johnson continued to support local agriculture. He made sure to source as much produce as possible from nearby farms throughout the year. He even started a loyalty program for his customers, offering discounts on locally grown fruits and vegetables. Thanks to Mr. Johnson's efforts, the eco-savvy green grocer had become the heart of the community. People flocked to his store, not just for the fresh and delicious food, but also for the sense of unity and care for the environment. The town had truly embraced the idea of supporting local agriculture and eating locally grown food. Question, what does a green grocer do to support local agriculture? Check the video description for the answer.